Okay, just woke up, landed late last night from Bangkok where I was for two weeks, my friend's wedding, it was really fun, but I've put on a few pounds and I'm not as lean as I'd like, definitely feeling a bit softer. I'm normally sitting around 158 to 159 pounds, and about 163, 164 at the moment, so um, either the scale's broken or I've put on a little bit of water weight and then maybe a little bit of fat. That's fine, I was fasting when I was in Thailand, but I wasn't tracking macros, I was definitely drinking more alcohol. So watch this space, 30 day shredding gonna come. Daily vlogs and watch me get lean and ripped in 30 days by tracking macros and getting back properly in the gym. I start the day with this really nice fragrant Korean tea. Um, yeah, just get back to hydrating properly and intermittent fasting for sure. Been working for a few hours on the way to have a coffee, have a break, get some steps in. Um, but yeah, really utilizing intermittent fasting in a calorie deficit is the best way. Just push your breakfast back, way back till lunchtime. Um, for me, I'm going to like 1, 2 p.m. and then when I get to eat, I get to eat loads of food. So simple. My current macros at the moment are gonna be around 250 grams of carbs, 50 grams of fat, and 165 grams of protein every day. It's 12.30 midday here, just got back from getting some coffee, um, doing some work on the computer, feeling a bit lagging, but I guess that's just jet lag, right, adding it back here till late last night, didn't get to bed till about 12.30, woke up about 6.30, so I got about six hours sleep. Um, having some carbonated water at the moment, which is good for while you're fasting, actually helps blunt hunger. But I'm not actually hungry at the moment. Um, I'm, last time I ate was about 6 p.m. UK time, it was on the plane, so I'm 18 hours, 18 and a half hours into a fast, feeling fine. I think I might push this to a 24 hour fast, which I'd like to kind of reset the body. Just popped out to get some food because I was running low, didn't have anything in really because I've been away. Uh, I just got some carrots, some mushrooms, kind of this mixed edamame salad that was on reduced, it was nothing, so why not? Apples, I got some wholemeal rolls, uh, some eggs, some high protein yogurt, some baby spinach, some bananas, lemons, and I think I'm just gonna have like a veggie, um, kind of mixed rice with some eggs tonight. Um, and I'm gonna use this, this is like a gold sock. This is a Korean dish, you can heat it up make my favorite bibimbap dish that Ellie got me, that's sick. But yeah, this food should tie me over for the next few days, the next day or two. And as you can see, it's just clean whole foods. Uh, I think a lot of the food in Thailand was kind of salty and MSG and stuff like that, and I feel a bit bloated. So I just wanna get back to whole natural foods, lots of water. The weather's really nice. Oh, let me put that ISO down. The weather's really nice today, so. Even though I'm feeling a bit tired, I might just go for a run and do some chin-ups or something like that. Uh, keep it chill and just get some sort of activity in there because it's time to get shredded. Just turned up, which is sick, which is my monthly supply of Coco Pro. Yeah, sorted out. I was going to fast until 6pm. It's 2pm now. I'm feeling kind of peckish and I want to do uh, a light jog, maybe some chins, so I'm gonna get a little bit of energy in the system. One small apple, two bananas to break my fast, and then I'll probably wait until dinner time to have my main meal. I finished a uh, simple workout. I ran for 20 minutes to a park uh, near where I live, found a bar, did 10 chin ups, uh, 20 bodyweight squats, 20 uh, push ups, and then with a minute breather, five rounds. So, altogether, 50 push ups, ah, altogether, 50 uh, pull ups, 100 uh, push ups, and 100 bodyweight squats. Oh, I'm tired. I'm gonna refuel with a Coco Pro, 20 grams of protein, go home, do some work and then I have dinner. 4 p.m. I couldn't wait till dinner, so I've just rustled up 80 grams of oatmeal, 50 grams of chocolate whey protein, 60 grams of peanut, no sorry, 60 grams of banana, uh, drizzle of honey, and a bit of cinnamon. This should do until dinner time. 
this is pretty much my dinner. It's like stir fried veggies with rice on the bottom and a fried egg and I've got some spicy gojujang which is Korean uh, red bean sauce underneath that. The bowl's kind of small so I've split it into two. So this is my first serving and the second serving is going to look exactly the same. This is round two. We're in this dulcet bowl that I showed you before. You can actually heat it up. It's like a, it's a stone bowl. So you can heat it up and it makes the rice all crispy and it's just so good. This is round two. Last bit of food of the day. This is 250 grams of low fat Greek high protein yogurt. A little bit of vanilla protein powder and some cinnamon on top. And then let's check out the macros and see where we're at. 214 grams of carbs, a little bit under 250 where I should be at. Uh, 50 fat where I should be at, 42, I'm fine with that. Being under is better than at the moment. And 160 grams of protein, all good. Day one in the books, see you tomorrow for day two.